Hey, what's up everyone? You're here with Goran from Pig Dogs, and you're here for your free picks uh, from this EuroCup 2024 qualifications on Thursday, March 23rd. Uh, we have three groups going on on Thursday, guys, and this is the video for the games from Group J. Uh, we have three games, and uh, Portugal is playing, Bosnia and Iceland are playing, and Slovakia is hosting Luxembourg. Uh, and we'll see what can we get out of these three games. Can we get any nice picks? Can we get some nice plus money? And uh, I think we actually can. Uh, now, feel free to check out the rest of the free picks up on the Pig Dogs YouTube channel. We have a few more videos as well. Uh, so check those out. Get the rest of your free picks, guys. And of course, subscribe and hit that like button. Uh, the first game we will talk about is between Bosnia and Iceland. And uh, Bosnia is actually a... I would say a pretty big favorite at minus 125 here, but uh, they are also coming into this uh, World Cup, Euro Cup qualifications with new head coach, uh, some new names in their roster, and uh, definitely they look like a new team. Uh, as far as Iceland goes, they have been building up since that Euro Cup, I believe 2016 was, when they reached, what, the quarterfinals or the semifinals or something like that. But after that, they kind of drop off the map, but uh, they have been slowly developing that talent and uh, maybe it's not time for them yet to, to make that final step, but uh, they are definitely back on, on, on the scene of the European football and uh, I definitely think that uh, they will be competitive in, 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 in this group and they definitely have enough determination and quality to uh, fight for that second place. Uh, of course, Portugal will be the team that uh, will most likely win the top spot. Uh, as far as this game goes, I don't have a lot of confidence in Iceland right now, but uh, I don't have a lot of confidence in Bosnia's defense as well. And for that reason, my pick here is simple. I'm going to take Iceland to score a goal. It's minus 165. It's not a fantastic price, but definitely good enough for this first round of the qualifications where uh, every team will try to step up and start the qualifications on a positive note. So I'm taking Iceland to score. In the second game, guys, Portugal is hosting Liechtenstein, and uh, we can see that Portugal is, uh, I would say, a slight favorite at minus 10,000 here, compared to Liechtenstein plus 6,600 uh, 6, uh, underdogs that they are, and uh, they definitely should be because... Uh, Liechtenstein is one of the weakest teams in, in Europe, in the world overall. They haven't won any of their last 25 games. Uh, they have never beaten Portugal in the past. And uh, they haven't won any of their last 13 games on their own. Now, Liechtenstein is definitely the biggest uh, favorite to be in the last place after the qualifications and in this group. And I honestly don't think that they can start these qualifications by doing anything positive. Now, that also means that it's very hard to find value in this uh, match. We have to come up with something wild. We have to come up with something out of the box to get some value out of it. And I believe I did because um, yesterday I read the title of an article that Cristiano Ronaldo has a chance to break some kind of record here. I don't know what kind. Uh, I'm, I assume it has something to do with goals. And uh, I assume he will be in the starting lineup here because... Uh, Portugal is starting the qualifications with a new head coach, which is uh, who is Roberto Martinez, uh, the former Belgium coach. And uh, I believe he will try to change uh, the game style that Portugal plays a little bit, but not by much, to be honest. And uh, I think that he will put Ronaldo up, up front to lead the charge for Portugal once again. Now, with that being said, I'm going with, uh, with, with Cristiano Ronaldo to score the first goal in this game. It's plus 170. I admit we need a lot of luck in this one uh, because Portugal has a lot of talent up front and uh, Ronaldo might not get the first goal. But to me, honestly, this is the only thing that makes sense. We can take a different player props, of course, uh, because we do expect Portugal to score three, four, five, six goals here for sure. Uh, but then again, you have to choose your, your picks wisely and uh, we do not have a lot of players for the plus money or close to plus money. So I decided to go with Cristiano Ronaldo to score the first goal in this game at plus 170. And the third and final game of this group, J guys, is going to be between Slovakia and Luxembourg. Now, Slovakia definitely a pretty heavy favorite here at minus 195. I honestly think that they should be even bigger favorites. 
Uh, but what the books are considering probably is the fact that uh, Luxembourg hasn't lost any of their last five games and they have actually beaten Slovakia in the past but that was like 12 years ago in a friendly game. Uh, Slovakia is also undefeated in their last three games however they failed to beat Belarus, they failed to beat Montenegro and they failed to beat Chile and the first two are let's be honest not the the crop of the cream of the European football but definitely two solid national teams while uh, Slovakia has enough quality they are much more deeper team than Luxembourg is and they have many more let's call them notable names that some of the people might recognize and on top of that they are by far the better defensive team here so uh, I'm gonna put my money on Slovakia to win and over 2.5 goals at plus 163 uh, I think that if we take Slovakia on the body line with something else in the double, that might be the way to go. But as a single pick here, I think it's definitely worth the shot of, of, of taking this one uh, for a nice plus money because Slovakia is playing at home and uh, they will definitely be fighting with Portugal for that top spot, if not for the top spot, for that second place for sure. So I do like Slovakia to win and over 2.5 goals at plus 163. That's it, everyone. Thank you for joining me here. These were free picks from this Group J of the Euro Cup 2024 qualifications. Uh, make sure you check out the rest of the free picks up on the Pigdoms YouTube channel. And make sure you subscribe and hit that like button. Guys, we do appreciate it a lot. That's it. Enjoy your Thursday. Good luck with your bets. And uh, I'll see you soon with more free picks.